As we celebrate the holiday season, one group says it's important to remember some families will still have that empty seat at the dinner table as they've lost loved ones serving their country. Today, Gold Star families from across Illinois gathered in Springfield to honor loved ones for their annual Gold Star Christmas tree lighting at the Abraham Lincoln Presidential Library. Illinois Capitol Bureau Chief Max Cotton has more from the event. The holidays are typically a time of celebration and joy as families and friends reconnect. For Gay Eisenhower of Pinckneyville, Monday was a family reunion of sorts. She reunited with her fellow Gold Star family members for the annual Christmas tree lighting in Springfield. This is our family Christmas for our sons and daughters that have given the ultimate sacrifice. We get to spend time together, we laugh, we cry, we grieve together. Eisenhower has been coming to this family reunion for 20 years. Her son Wyatt was killed while serving in the Army in Iraq in 2005. When you have 20 years of something, you celebrate it. 20 years at a job, a 20-year anniversary, and with this 20 years is I've survived it. This year, he's one of 350 fallen heroes whose ornaments are hanging from the Gold Star Tree, with their family members having the honor of placing their commemorative ornaments. We are gathered here as a family to celebrate and honor our loved ones and each other. Honoring them reminds us that our memories and our mourning, however fresh or faded, is collective. And for Eisenhower, who wears a gold star pin and her son's dog tags to honor him, she's proud to be a gold star mother. But the respect and the honor that is given you as a gold star mom. is something that you have to be one to explain it. And I really hope there's not any more that join this unwanted club. In Springfield, Max Cotton, WGEM News.